Therapeuter Sanitation. Part 12. Bamboo for grey water treatment. Well, as we have heard, it doesn't make sense to mix toilet wastewater and the rest of the wastewater. And uh, when we find new solutions for toilets, it is uh, of course also necessary to treat the rest of the wastewater and that is what we call grey water. That's all the wastewater from uh, washing clothes, from uh, the, the kitchen and uh, showering, washing and so on. So this uh, grey water uh, can be treated very easily in uh, a uh, constructed wetland and uh, we prefer one type of constructed wetland that works with bamboo. Uh, bamboo is uh, available in very many different species and uh, it grows uh, very well and it also absorbs nutrients that are uh, in, in where also some nutrients are in the grey water and uh, this is a little bit of a wastewater installation. It looks beautiful, it's green all year round it produces uh, wood and uh, maybe usable also as fuel and the wastewater will be uh, used to irrigate the bamboo and it must be fed only maybe every three days once a week so that the bamboo does not die off it doesn't like to be wet all the time uh, uh, so we make uh, several of these uh, installations and distribute the wastewater from one to the other and with that we can have a highly productive uh, reuse of the wastewater and uh, with this we have the combination of a beautiful green spot in the neighborhood and treating the great grey water at the same time. Also fuel is produced and that can for example uh, feed uh, wood gas stoves that are used for cooking and the charcoal could be used in the uh, installations for uh, terra preta production then. So that would be sort of a holistic system and bamboo can be a nice component for that. If you are further interested, please click on some of these uh, flickering subjects.